Hey TMZ, what's up Harvey? My name is Vanessa Morris and I would love to join the TMZ sports team. I've been an athlete and a lover of sports my whole life, so this would be basically like getting paid to do what I already love to do. Watch sports and follow all of my favorite athletes' personal lives. Here's a couple of stories that I've been working on for you this week. Are you the best boxer in the world? Are you new to LA? Find friends by posting your address on Instagram. Does this sound a little desperate or creepy? Apparently not for the pound for pound best boxer in the whole world, Floyd Money Mayweather. He's been recently posting lots of images of his new crib in downtown LA, 315 West 5th Street to be exact. And inviting folks from the neighborhood to go and, you know, hang out. Well, let's go, let's turn up. Skier Lindsey Vaughn is reportedly pretty worried that she thinks her boyfriend Tiger Woods would cheat on her. I don't know why she would think that. Apparently the person she's worried about most is Tiger's ex-wife, Elin Nordegren. The National Enquirer reports that Tiger, his two children, and Elin plan to meet up in Sweden this summer for a vacation. But Vaughn is demanding that Woods bring her along for the trip. A source close to Lindsay states, Lindsay is convinced that Tiger still has feelings for Elin, and if he got the chance, he would dump Lindsay in a flash to get back together with her, the source said. Last March, the couple, Tiger and Lindsay, announced on Facebook that they were dating. This is Tiger's first public romance since he got divorced almost three years ago. Last week, the New York Post reports that Elin quote, really likes Lindsay and she thinks that he's a, she's a good influence on Tiger. But Lindsay has already said publicly she has no intentions of marrying Tiger. She told Vogue magazine, quote, no thanks. I am definitely not getting married to anyone. I can't wait to see how this plays out. Well, this isn't Kansas. Nork and Aaron Hernandez click his heels three times and go home. Now a brick commemorating happier times in college has been removed from the infamous Gator Walk in front of the state. The university has also made this statement. We did not feel it was appropriate to celebrate Aaron Hernandez. We put together an immediate plan after the initial news broke to remove his likeness and name in various private and public areas in the facility. We were able to implement some of the changes immediately and the brick removal was more of a complex process to complete with our vendors. The plan was to have everything done by the end of July. All right, Harvey and TMZ, that's all you get for free. Put me on payroll, dude, I'm ready to go. TMZ Sports, my name is Vanessa Morris.